Right then, so I've come down there. I came down the steps. I did do it sideways coming down. Before now, I think I've just come down the grass, but I feel a bit more fragile today. So I've taken my time, actually. Now we've just got a few steps here. Then we're going down into the wood. Oh, I'm cooling off as well. I had to think I was getting overheated, you know. I, I had planned to take my jumper off earlier. <sighs> Left it on for quite a while, actually. This evens up in a minute, just to get down these steps. It's better to use them when, rather than trip over them, see? <sighs> these are the, what I call my secret steps. Go up there and then up. Not everybody knows about this little location. I did it by trial and error. I knew that style had to lead somewhere. So basically I just decided to follow it one day and see where it went. And other locals were no ways in and out, in and out like that. But you don't have to come down them steps probably, you can go through another way from the top. Do you know what I mean? It's nice and cool actually, I feel, I'm feeling better already. But that's the steep way up. People, Some people will probably know a way you go across that bit and then up a bit, you know, and do it like that. Events in the world, well, Great Britain, or the UK, America and Australia have got a pact to produce um, nuclear submarines in Australia. Now that was weird because I was just talking about Zara's great grandfather not long ago. He went, he was an uh, Englishman but was loaned to the Australian Navy in the First World War to help run the AE-1. Basically it, um, oh look at that, I'm not taking that one out. Look, I got one of these at home, but it's probably full of bugs. Yeah, I got a bigger one than that. No, I'm not, I'm not putting that in my bag. Don't know what I'll call out of it, do you? Yeah, so that's a bit of news. Uh, China and France are very, very unhappy because apparently France had been had arranged this deal with Australia to build them, for them to build them their subs. But they've... They've cancelled it, Australia, and the French are very, very unhappy because it was a massive deal worth billions. I don't know what the Americans are doing with it. They haven't included the New Zealand either. But apparently China aren't very happy. They see it as um, immature and, and um, like a threat almost. Um, but, of course, China's big, so countries will gang up on them, won't they? And then, okay everyone, we'll carry on. We're in the valley now. I've come down off Robo Hill Fort, down the steep steps. Now I'm back in the valley. And uh, some lovely trees here, beautiful. It's five to two, so we're doing all right. We should, we should get back for the last bus. Look at that lovely tree though. He's been there for ages. He's gorgeous. A yew tree, aren't you? 
He's got some berries. He's got some berries there. He's looking really well. And they all are. I can see some wild sheep. Well, they might actually be domesticated sheep. They look a bit like the goats. Yeah, like I said, for anyone who's just starting, this is a walk I've done quite a few times over the years, coming up through the valley here. Sometimes uh, there is a stream the other side of that wall that's been created, so that uh, usually so horses and that can drink. Um, or it's, and when it's really bad, the water gushes down here, by the way. Yeah. And um, the person that's bought the pink house has been doing all this work here, clearing and tidying and everything, making more land accessible for himself. He has chopped quite a few big trees down for more light to come to the wood. But look at that lovely scene there, look. Isn't that gorgeous, that tree there with all, all the um, ivy growing up the top there? Isn't that pretty? I'm going to take a picture of that one. All right, this video going through. I'm sure he was doing that bit when I came last. In there, he's probably given up. They do after a while, it's hard work, isn't it? Oh, hard work. He's done all that though. It's hard work now, isn't it? Looks hasn't been done on the outside. Oh, it's taking a little bit down it, doesn't it? Takes a while to do a place up, doesn't it? Let's look a little bit. Let's look at the toilet in. There's the stream. Just looks a little bit. I don't know how to call it, really. Um, oh. Oh, the gate shut. I don't know if anyone is in it. I mean, he could have um, had to sell. Covid, who knows? Could be a victim of that, fair load. No money. Looks like it stopped. He hadn't done much to the house. <sighs> okay. Oh God, I hope I can get out. I'll climb over it. Oh. Yeah, not even that sucking like it's deteriorating, isn't it? All right, over and out a minute. Now. Right, they're going to leave the pink cottage. I was just saying, it doesn't look like there's anyone living in it exactly. It just makes you wonder if they've if there's a vehicle there, if they've had, been furloughed or you know had to give it up. I just don't know. Yeah, past year has affected a lot of people. So this has been. Stone walled and all here, look. Nice, isn't it? Stone wall layering. Unless that place has been up there like that for a few years now. Takes time, doesn't it? Takes time. Yeah, looks nice though. Nice and open, airy, light. Like a tower. I've gone past the pink cottage. I was talking and then there's 
two workmen were too close. I took a couple pictures of the wooden tower to house. There's another one that's been done up a bit here. And then I carry on further around the corner and then there's a, another lovely little place. And then well, this is the stream I'll be following all the way back. This one. What's worrying me the most is if the sun's going to come out. That last stretch of my walk. I have to wear my hat actually if I get up near Cheddar. So that is quite powerful when that comes out, that bit of the walk. The sun is right over you. Oh yeah, there's that place. I don't know if that's a holiday net or anything. Nice though, isn't it? Very nice. That could have originally been an old house. I'd have to have a look at my photos and then they've done it up with wooden cladding and stuff. I've got a feeling that was already there, that building. I can remember when they put all the the water piping in along here. This was all dug up along here when they wanted to connect the house further up to the water supply. Yeah, that's always been there. That one. Of course, there won't be any need to do a lot of videoing over once we get past Tiny's Farm, is there? Because you, we, we do that so often. Now, this is a lovely view here of this cotton. She's, I love it because she's always got her washing out. I love seeing washing on the line like that. You know what I mean? What a lovely view, isn't it? What a lovely place. Oh, lovely. Golly. Look at that lovely little house. She's sat out in the garden. I'm going to turn off a minute.